I myself am in disbelief. Bishop takes d4. Ooh, I'm afraid. I'm still very afraid because of one second, one oh. second on the clock. 86 check. Uh oh, Jan blundered. Oh, that's good. But will she be able to uh, draw this? Well, when Jan tries d7. D7. Seven. Oh, that's nice. King b7. Yeah, I think Jan not only blundered into a draw, he was close. To like, oh my god! No! Time! Nice. Mm, what? Okay. Sure. Sure. Push, can you to okay. I think this is simply winning. Oh, look at the time. I even forgot about the time. Hikaru's going to pull this back. What a fighter. Oh, that's a nice tactic. Queen E3, Rook F1. Do, 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 do. It's one of those ones. Woohoo! Yeah. And that wins the game on the spot. And Aronian does resign. Way. Hikaru is back in business. Back in business. Back in business. And the point is, if you take that rook, you lose the queen with check. And of course, that is winning. And if you move the king, then this one is winning as well. And well done, Hikaru. Brilliant. And, it, you know, take here. This is actually checkmate because you can't come out to this square. So... We're in Montgomery and she spent most of her youth in uh, Dothan. Everybody's drinking Perry in St. Louis. They give it to the players for free. You're from Canada, so they think you're slow, eh? Now, does Alabama, does that state exist because of Sharpies? If Sharpies weren't around, you wouldn't have a state? That's too bad. In this case, it actually turns Dingley Wren into the much higher rated bullet player at 2800 versus Sam. So either way, what we have here is a case where neither of these guys have played enough bullet on our site for, un for us to have an indicator of what their true bullet strength is. So may the best man win. We'll see how it goes. Um, now, if I'm not, I, I think I might be going crazy. I just have to, to ask, uh, did Ding change his shirt? Rook F7, probably Rook... Wait, there's still matrix. How do I do this? Rook here, maybe? Oh, I should have taken. Don't know why I didn't take. Please play rook f7. Okay, that's also... Wait, this is just a draw. The king can't escape my checks. Oh, stale matrix all the way. Okay. So, he ate the needle. We took him to the bed in the morning. I'm, I cried all day, literally. And I couldn't go back to sleep. And, um... What bottle? Oh, ha! <laughs> ha! That's coffee. Um... And they're like, okay, we're gonna, like, you know... Can you check first? Is that anything? Well, you could come with a check. Um, yo ho ho ha, yo, what's that name? Yo, yo ho ha han, yo ho ha han. Trying to say that fast ten times. Come on, everyone at home, trying to say that fast ten times. Yo ho ha han, 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 yo There you go, that's my effort. Just to, just to get my, get my, get my mouth moving a little bit more. Yo ho ha han, yo ho ha han. Yo ha ha han comes with yo ha ha han attack and yo ha ha han. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah, yeah. Come on, everyone. Can you do better? Alrighty, good game, Lucas. Leaner, Leonor, 02 says, uh, 
What did you do before you became a full-time chess player? Uh, I, I worked as a construction worker. I was building houses. That's what I did before I played chess. <laughs> yes, I was a construction worker, you guys, for like three years before I became a professional chess player. Um, check. Oh. There's a queen there. Jeez. <laughs> Sloppy town. Okay, one more game. Alrighty. I think he missed the sound chance that in those games. And then uh, maybe also I missed the sound chance. Psychologically, did you ever did you ever lose your confidence at some point where you you know would that would that be something that was hard to gather in the format? Did you feel like you lost your confidence at any point? Wei Yi, um, we have uh, an epic comeback on on uh, the docket here today. Apparently, we didn't know, but MVL was down five and a half, one and a half. Now leads it eleven to seven. Just a complete turnaround. Four games down. Now four games up. Shout out to Don and Naroditsky hanging out in the Twitch chat. Go to twitch.tv uh, slash whatever his channel is, Dr. Naroditsky. Gotta, you know, Donya, I don't think anybody has changed their channel name more than you, like, in the history of Twitch, not just, like, like chess. So shout out to you, buddy. Um, but anyway, give him a follow. Uh, there you go, GM Nero. Then knight takes e6 would be checkmate. Can you believe it? So... Knight to c7 played, and f3, and I can't believe it. I can't believe it. He plays rook b7. No, he doesn't really, and it's actually only a check there. Yeah, he doesn't. He doesn't play that, but what he, what he does do, he goes rook e8, e4, and now he goes rook b7. Oh, my words. Usually you have a backward c-pawn. Now I'm not going to have a backward c-pawn because I'm going to trade it for your d-pawn. And knight a6, misplaced. But, oh, Queen C1. Oh, yeah. oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> that was a mouse sleep? Yeah. Jan was like, Jan was like oops. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Popoff was uh, a real, you know, real gentleman. And he was quite funny, apparently, because it was played in London. And there was a lot of press there. Chess was very, very popular in London at the time. Not so much anymore, unfortunately. And all this press um, came up to Karpov and... Uh, you know, they wanted to say hello to him and stuff. And Karpov just said, I, I speak no English. I speak no English. No English. No, no English. Don't understand you. No English. Sorry, sorry. No English. Neat, neat. And then it's... The knight is pinned. Take that Queen takes oh, D7. Is it, is it? Is it? No, hang on. Is that a draw? Oh, he blundered a perpetual. Oh, my gosh, Sam. So neither one of us wins. Oh, but I'd my like to gosh. Say it. I'd like to say that that was an amazing game by Sam, but it's almost like at the end there, what he he knew that that was a perpetual, but he okay. kind of hooped himself into it, didn't he? The time is up. They didn't start another game, and that was played in Yugoslavia. Uh, and you know who won that one? Who won the first ever, uh, you know, thing? It was actually uh, Peter Leko, Peter Leko, um, who you know. And of course, I'm reading this all from uh, Wikipedia. It's not like I have great knowledge. I've got Wikipedia in front of me. I'm not trying to be clever. I'm just reading Wikipedia. Six but... A3, bishop g2, but now black can play rook b2. Okay, or rook b3. Both moves unleash the bishop. That was the point to guard d6. He can put the bishop on c5. Try to spy squares like f2 and don't... Oh my gosh, and he... Wait, did Lovey just resign there? I have no idea. I'm just going to back up and take Ooh. a look. What about some crazy stuff? Okay, I'm getting really carried away here. What about this takes, this takes, this one, check. And if you go king d4, boom! Checkmate! <laughs> no longer in position to guard the most critical squares. He changes the structure by directly challenging the light squares in the center with d5. And uh, just like that, now he's going to resupport the strength with e5. And just like that, I think I have a new co-host next to me. Vidic, can you hear me? 
Did it? Is this a joke? Vid it. Good talk, buddy. Good talk. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now oh, I hey, can... there you are. What's up, dude? <laughs> Hi. How's it going? It's going great, man. Fabiano, and that is heading into F4 in some situations. Rook A... Hang on a minute. Rook A1 cast... Castling? No. This is what we... Let me just refresh the page. I've got rook a1 and now castling. I know we were talking about castling. I know we were talking about castling and we were getting really carried away and having so much fun with his castling. Has Fabiano been listening and thinking, yeah, I love that castling move. I'm going to castle, man. Hang on. Okay, there we go. I said, don't you dare run. I actually said, told the time. Yeah, time. Once again, time. But the position was already lost anyway. Look at four. Even 